Since I'm a money, yeah, I run it up. Seven so damn much, I'm looking down, I gotta stop. Yo, what's good, guys? I'm back with another video. So for today, we got some packages at home that I'm about to go unbox and everything for you guys. You should already know what it is by the thumbnail. Um, but right now, I'm just running a couple errands. And then in the next clip, I'm going to show you guys what I got and do like a whole full like um, unboxing for you guys. So make sure you stay tuned. And yeah. Also, guys, I couldn't end the clip without, you know, showing you guys the seats. <laughs> oh, my gosh. So like one of the best seats ever. Like it's pretty. It's. It's pretty comfortable, I would say. Not if you're sitting in there too, too long, but I mean, they just look way too good in the car. Like, I can't even lie. But yeah, let's get to the clip and I'm gonna unbox everything for you guys and explain to you guys what I got and what I plan to do. All right, guys, so I'm finally back at home. So I'm about to unbox my bags for you like I was talking about in the other video. And we're about to get right into it. So basically those two boxes right there, those are the suspensions, the front and the rear um that is the um tank right there the tank i got is a three gallon seamless tank i'm gonna show you guys everything in this video so don't worry um and then the last box right there that's the management and all the cables and stuff like that but we're about to get into it right now <laughs> all right so right here this is the tank that i was telling you guys about kind of like already murdered the box but um yeah everything's already pre-opened so it makes it easier for this video but let's get into it right now just grab the box Put it right there. All right, so this um, three gallon seamless tank, like I said before, this, I bought this from AccuAir. I think it's like A-C-C-Q-U-R and then Air, something like that. I'll show you guys like the little name so you guys can see. You guys are trying to get a tank as well. So, check it out. All right, so this is the tank right here. Hold on, let me put it down. All right, cool. Focus, all right, bam. So this is the tank right here. Um, it's 18 inches long, I believe. And I wanna say it's like, um, maybe like five inches wide, something like that, four. But anyways, yeah, this is the, my air tank. I do plan when I install it, um, I'm gonna have it painted or wrapped or something like that. And that should be pretty cool what I'm gonna do because I'm gonna paint it or wrap it and I'm gonna also put um, my Instagram decal like here in a cool font and maybe do like a design on the top, something like that, you know, something cool. Um, anyways, yeah, this is it. Just has like a hole right there. And I believe on this side, it should be two. Two or is it three? I guess two. Two on this side, and then two on that side as well. And then I guess let me try to stand it up so you guys can see it standing up. <laughs> yeah, this is how it looks standing up. And place it down. All right. Bam. Don't slide, don't roll, don't roll, don't roll. All right, cool. So then what else we get in the box too? Um, I believe it does come with the, um, the clamps. I already opened it, so. I find it here. Yeah. So it comes with these. These are like the little latches to latch it down. And then there are also the clamps inside of here as well. So, um, let me see if I could like kind of demonstrate to you guys how it would look. So it would go something, hold up. There you go. I'm gonna do one side because you guys will get the, the gist of it. So, you know, go like that, bam, bam. And then you put the little latch on it and then it stays in the spot. So and that's pretty much it for the tank. And now I'm about to get into the, um, the front suspension and then the rear and then the management. I'm gonna show you guys everything and expl explain to you guys like how everything works. If you guys don't know how bags work, I'm pretty sure you guys do know, but just for those that don't know. But yeah, let me put this back in the box. So um, everything is all organized and I'm ready to go take it to my shop. And like I said, I don't know if I said this before, but I'm gonna make it into a three part video. So this is the first one, I unbox it and everything. And the 
the second one, I dropped my car off or whatever. And the third one, I'll show you guys how it looks and explain all the setup and everything. But let me take this off and put it back in the box and I'll hit you guys right back. All right, so now I'm about to show you guys, I believe this is the front or the rear, I kind of forgot, but we're about to find out right now. So let me pick this one up and I'm gonna show you guys. Oh. Oh. It's kind of hard picking it up with one hand. Ooh. All right. So bam, focus, all right, cool. So this is how the airlift box will come for one of the suspensions. Um, oh, let, me not, let me not show that address there. Don't pull up on me. You don't want that smoke. Anyways, so let me open it up so you guys can see. This is the, this looks like this is the front, yeah. So when we open it, stay open. open it this is how it looks when you get it you have the little installation guide i guess i'll open this up and show you guys how it looks um mine is of course a rear wheel drive so if you have all-wheel drive you have to get the all-wheel drive one for your q60 or q50 um yeah, let me put this to the side for now bam and then these are the front struts so before i take this part out let me show you guys the um, cables, we got that one right there, and then it comes with two, of course, for both sides. So bam, bam, you know, place it back so everything is in place, nothing's missing when I got to take it to go get installed. Um, where's the other thing? There's another thing inside here. Oh, well. I'm gonna take that part off, place that right there. Let's see, let me open this side. So, oh, let me put my phone down real quick. All right, place it down again. All right, so this is how the bag looks. This part, of course, is where all the air, you can kind of hear it. <laughs> so that's where all the air is stored inside the bag. Um, and this is the adjustable part too, as well. Um, but yeah, that's about it. Let me show you guys the top part. See that? That's where you bolt it all up inside the um, to replace basically like my coils because I am on BC coils too. If anybody is wondering, I sometimes get some messages about that. I'm not on springs. Springs are fine if you want to run springs, but I'm on BC coils. So, and then I also do plan to sell my coils after putting this on my car. So if anyone's interested in buying that, um, they are for sale. So. Um, DM me or something before I they get sold because I'm gonna put it on my own account and yeah so uh, these are the adjustables too see it adjustables to adjust them to the height wanted got that piece in there dampers that goes in that part and I believe that's really everything from inside this part. And then of course, it's just for the other side. So it's basically the same exact thing as that. And yeah, let me try to, I guess, show you guys how big it is. Oh, that. Like that. Oh, yeah. And also whenever you buy this type of stuff, they do come with warranty. So if anything was to happen um, or go wrong with the bags, you do have warranty. So just keep that in mind as well. So that's really about it. I don't think there's anything else really inside of here. This is just padding and stuff like that. Yeah. yeah, that's about it. So let me put this one back away and then I'm gonna get into this box right here. This back on here, guys. But yeah, I guess we're gonna talk to you guys a little bit. So the reason why I'm going on bags too is because like, there's too many speed bumps here. Way too many speed bumps. In Florida, there's a thousand speed bumps. And all the roads are all trash. Like, I promise you. You go to Miami like one time, speed bump. Or pothole, 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 pothole. Every second. So, I'm gonna be using this to um, put my car on monster truck site, monster truck setting. So then basically, 
I could avoid the potholes and save my exhaust because my motor down exhaust, which my exhaust is motor down. Those that don't know, I'll probably make a video about that too later also as well. I gotta like catch up on my, all my videos. I've been trying to tell you guys I'm gonna make. But um, that exhaust hangs really low and I like scrape it a lot. So that's really the reason why I'm going to bags. Plus I just wanna do something cool for my birthday and this is what I'm doing. But yeah, hold on, let me put this back. I'm gonna put my phone down real quick. So yeah, like I was saying, the, the roads here are just plastic. Like, oh my gosh. Can barely drive without like falling down a ditch. But look, this is like the instructions real quick before I go through the um, the rear struts and show you guys that. But just for anyone that was interested in how it looks. It's pretty um straightforward install and everything, just like coilovers. The most interest in the most um the most important part is really just the management and making sure everything is running smoothly to your trunk. Oh damn. Oh no. We don't want that. Oh no. We ain't got no we ain't got no meat on that bone. No. But yeah. We need we need ours to look like that. Not like that. Definitely not like that. But yeah, that's really it. So let me get to the uh, get to the rear strut. I'm gonna show you guys that. All right, guys. So now I'm about to go and unbox the rear struts right now. So let me go pick it up. Show you guys how it looks. All right. So we got the rear for the struts. how the rear looks, uh, some instructions, and then with this one it comes with the adjustables, and I'm not sure what those are, the dampers are in here too, as well as so there's this part too. These are the um, these are the dampers for. Um, it's for the back, of course. Yeah. It's just a little bit longer, so you can change it. Put that right back in there as well. And then let me take this part off so I can show you guys how it looks. echo was so loud but anyways um got these as well same thing from the front same thing for the rear comes with two of them so it's pretty nice it's good quality good material so it's back over there and now for the part you guys want to see take one of these out so you can see how it looks probably put the camera down real quick Rear bags look. It's like a thicker double double band. I don't know how to call this. I'm not familiar. But this is really. But yeah, this how it looks. Same thing. This is what they should say. If you order for like a Q60, it says Q50, but it's, they work the same exact way. Same suspension. You just gotta make sure you put if you're all-wheel drive or rear wheel drive. Uh, Usually get that word tongue tied. So this how it looks. Comes with a little, little thing right here. It says air lift. Bam. Yeah. And then it says all these numbers right there. And then around right there too. But yeah, it's pretty cool. Try to show you guys how big it is. Kind of perspective. That's it, just laying in the box. So same thing as the other one. They're both um, identical. And this is 
insulation guide, pretty much the same thing as the front, but I believe the rear is actually a little bit harder to. But hey, uh, I won't be installing this one though. I will have my shop do it. All right, guys, so I'm here with the last box. Um, this is like another day because I had to do something the other day. So that's why you see the other boxes aren't there anymore. But um, we're about to open this last one. This last one is the management. And yeah, so there's a lot of stuff in here we're gonna cover. So yeah, let's get into it. All right, guys, so once we open the box, this is what we see. We have some wrapping stuff there. Don't need that. Um, all right, so right here, these are my compressors. So I got the dual pack. So of course it's two in there. Um, when I was like looking up stuff, um, about bags and stuff like that. They said it was recommended to get two, not only cause it looks good, I'm doing it obviously cause I, you know, I like cosmetic stuff and stuff like that. But also if one compressor was to go out, I would have the other one to rely on. So I wouldn't be completely stranded in the middle of nowhere given a scenario. But we're about to get into that after we open this box first. And yeah, so let me take this, put it up here. Show you guys what's inside. All right, so once we open it, we have this um, drawstring bag. And yes, so I bought these bags from Bag Riders. So I actually bought it in April, which this video should go up. Um, well, actually this video might go up in May because I'm getting the car done on the 24th of April and it won't be done until, it won't be done until probably like that Saturday or Friday. So it, it really depends. But anyways, I got the, um, I ordered from Bag Riders because they had a better discount than Airlift's actual website, ironically. But we're about to get into that one after we get into this bag. So in here we have the Airlift Performance Compressor Harness. And we also have the, um, what is this? Uh, this is like the lines and stuff like that that you got to run. So you see it comes with all the hardware and everything. Let me place this over here. And then we have the 3H3P kit. And also if I didn't mention as well, this is the 3P, the 3P kit, yeah. It's not the height one. I didn't really need the height one. Um, if you wanna get the height one, it's cool, but I really didn't really need it, so. Um, yeah, but there's some more installation guides on it. Let's see, so that's how it'd be wired and everything. So I'm gonna show you guys that part and everything. But uh, let's get into what's in the bag. So in the bag, does this does it give me like a license plate thing? That's pretty cool. Give a nice license plate cover. What else is in the bag? Oh, they also gave me a shirt too. It's pretty cool, a bag rider shirt. And let's see what else. And they gave me this like container with stuff in it. Let me see what's inside. All right, so inside here, it looks like it's some, oh, it's some stickers, like decal stickers, bag riders, and they also gave me a keychain. That's pretty cool. I do need some more keychains on my, on my keys. Yeah, bag riders keychain. That's pretty cool. Let's see what else. It's another decal in there. And I think it's the same ones, but just a little bit bigger. Yeah, so this is the same, same thing, but just, much bigger as you can see and then put these back in there so then i have space to take out all the other stuff from in there place it on the table Never mind. Different diamonds, we outside, we outside, yeah. We be wildin', we outside, we outside. 